Hi, this is Saif from Safely Invest. Today I'm here with the call, uh, daily call for crude oil, gold, and currency pairs. Uh, this is first call from Safely Invest uh, going on air. And uh, I basically, I like to uh, be specific what trader has to do. I'm not going to discuss with, the, uh, discuss with you about the technical indicators and their moving averages and the Bollinger Band. No, I'm not. What you have to do, I'm going to discuss that. First of all, crude oil. Crude oil chart reflecting an aftermath of the disaster. The prevailing trend is very good. If you will look at the last two uh, sessions, it, it was really good. But the situation in crude oil is basically an aftermath of the disaster. So what we are going to do, uh, I recommend long above 2040. If it is trading above 2040, you can go long. And, and that, that long going to target 21.65, 21.90 area. Okay. And even if it is trading below, you can wait for the exhaustion of beers for going long on dip. So crude oil having only the long opportunity because the pressure in crude oil is below $18. So now let's move up to the uh, gold, gold spot. The metal is reflecting a little bit of indecision after the weekly closing and what we have to do, we have to be very careful, like if it is sustaining above 1697.30, it means bulls may do some efforts, a little bit of efforts and when they come up above 1704, you can go a daring long with the stop loss below 1697.30 for targeting 1712. The real excitement in gold is above 1712. So, but you can make a trade by using trading on level going daring long above 1704 and the short possibilities are only below 1692. So, no shorts as long as it is trading above 1692. If it is goes below 1692, just jump into short and tra target 1685 to 1683. Now let me discuss some currency pairs, Euro USD. Euro USD bull is still in a good shape and I believe uh, lo going long here is a better idea, but going long above 1.100. Remember that going long above 1.100 and shorts below 1.0970. These are the trigger and I don't want traders to go uh, trade between these triggers. Just go uh, on long or short upon given triggers. Now let's discuss pound USD. Pound USD pair look a little bit exhausted, right? Uh, in fact, it is uh, routine exhaustion. So what do, uh, what you can do here is going short below 1.2490. Just go short below 1.2490 with the stop loss above 1.2520. And then trailing your stop loss uh, above 1.2490 for targeting 1.2445 and then the utmost target 1.2410. It is a perfect bearish situation below 1.2395. So if it breaks to 1.2395, just uh, jump in new shorts, add more short to your trade. So bullish is a uh, possibility is quite far from here. I, I believe unless it goes above 1.2645, do not think of going long here in pound USD. Now come to the USD Canadian. The USD Canadian, uh, USD Canadian is uh, cu currently bulls are in power, but going long above 1.4110 is fine. Going long above 1.4110 and targeting 1.4200. But remember, the immediate target is 1.4155. And I'm encouraging shorts here only below 1.4005. Do not go short before 1.4005. I hope these uh, uh, triggers and calls will help you. And please do not uh, forget subscribing my channel. And uh, <coughs> if you like my post, if you like the call, just let me know in the comment box and we'll try to give you the notification and provide you the daily calls. Thank you for watching us.